Oh my god. god. I was money back to the wolves. I was shooting yesterday, bro. Alright, I should already started. Come on. Alright, alright. Alright, game. You know, you know what? It's times like this where, you know, like, I, I'm not even opposed to Tito, like, getting the, the lead on a percentage, but it's or or. And on top of that, he's using the Rage Master himself. <laughs> so. Okay. I bet you five to one if I tell Oro Oro, yo, play this like it's casual, this motherfucker will suck up an ass. Because I'm yeah, you notice in, that in tournament, <laughs> he plays so bad. But when you play him casual, it's like, what it's the like, fuck okay, is this? He's doing all this. He's like reading the shoes and shit. <laughs> he does everything that a real fucking Smash is supposed to do. But in tournament, you don't see this shit. And it's really oh my god, and no chunk from Oro Oro already. How is he not going to F guard? Tries to cheese him with the upbeat, but mistimes it. By going to the stage too close. All right, oh, tries to read the jump into center stage, but Aura Aura staying a little bit calm. Oh no, but too antsy with the hit. Aura Aura is gonna have to slow down the pace somehow with his with his um with his rage and his aura. Because the one thing about Lucario that most people should know is that look you no one can ever sleep on a high level Lucario. There you go with that oh side. Oh my god, died at 89. 89% he died at. Oh, but, but with, with a long range fight live, we don't care about that. But you know what? It's not done. Yeah. Alright. Interesting Tito combo. That's really good. Man. Oh, oh my god, he had it, yeah. he the hell it would have been an easy And that's the thing with Aura or though, like he like he's pretty known in the Capros community. He goes to every single Capros, never misses it. Shout out to him. But it'll be moments like that that makes us so disappointed. It's like, yo, you had that read, but you wasn't confident though. And you just have a whole like his his game plan is, is very like rhythmic rhythm. Very like simple in terms of rhythm. And that's what Tito's capitalizing on. Like with the whole ledge thing with Tito's forward smash, he knew that at that exact timing that Aura Aura was gonna jump up do something very predictable about the ledge. Trying Tito to pull out the shield. Tito is itching for that fucking down yeah. smash. He loves breaking nigga shields with that move. But that's the thing with Tito though, like Tito, Tito's a very like annoying fundamentally player and he'll try to abuse the shit out of that. He's like, all right, if this move can break shield, I'm gonna use this move since it breaks the shield. But yet, it's very slow, and if he catches you with it, oh, it's just ow. that's just how it is. I'm trying to remember what I was gonna say. Something about his down smash. Oh my god, another down yeah, smash! And you're yeah, definitely that's right. That. Yo, get and, the fuck out of here! Try oh, oh, oh. One last stock What's last. Going on that, Lena? All Aura or has to do is take his time oh, on recovery. God. Because Tito is going to capitalize on any mistake you do. Fuck this stage, bro. It's PS2, man. Nah, nah. I, didn't, I don't think it's PS2. Nah, man. That up smash literally takes out the entire fucking platform. But it does that on Battlefield, too. It does that on Battlefield. Oh. All the, ba all the tournaments will be pick, pick, pick any other stage. Besides Kalos. Because Kalos, the platform is out the side. Like, up smash is not hitting that shit. Oh nah, Tito almost lost. Yeah, last stock. Both of these, both of these players in game one having last stocks. Oh, shit. <laughs> I, I had so much hope for him too. Yo, I was. <laughs> I had so much hope for him. Yo, he has so much faith. <laughs> Yo, Aura. Yo, pretend, pretend you're playing casual, son. Yeah, Shinigami really, really wants all, all the really At least the game, though. At least the game. But it's going to be hard for him, though, because at least in terms of the, the bracket seating and stuff like that, Aura Aura really hasn't made any type of upset unless it goes Danny. Yo, I'm telling you right now, bro. Anybody who's watching Aura Aura play live, judge you, judge him all you want. But I dare you. I fucking dare you to try <laughs> the same shit with him off stream. <laughs> no tournament. <laughs> and you're not getting the same results. That's what I'm saying. Like, or, or he's really nice. He's a very humble player. Um, he might not have. Wow, 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 okay. All of that was just 28, though, sadly. But that's the thing with Lucario. He has really interesting early percent combos. But what makes Lucario struggle is that he has a hard time killing if you know his kill options. It is. So it's like, like Tito's very aware of that, so he barely 
All the stocks that Tito lost at game one was all because of command grabs of him shielding too much. But now, oh my god, I was gonna mention shields and Tito just fully dominates that entire stock. Or or have that one combo and Tito basically just zero to death him after that. I'll never understand violence that missed that confirmed. Yeah, did they ever come yeah. up with a fucking uh a a mod to, to make Violet look like Monster Hunter? Yeah. They did? They have the actual Monster Hunter character with sword and everything like that. Mods. That was actually one of the ones I was going to get last time before HDR became a thing and I was like, alright, alright. Violet yeah. skins is actually pretty cool. They look good back there. Alright, 83%. That's not too bad if you're a Lucario main right here with even stocks. Because you can, one simple combo can bring it all back right now. And you can tell Lucario has aura based on how shiny his pawns are. Yeah, like, besides the rage mechanic in Smash itself, and Lucario having aura himself, you can tell that Lucario's aura mechanics is activated based off his hands. So right now, Lucario's aura is a little bit, it's slowly activating all over again. Because his hands are glowing more bright. So if Aura Aura did like a bread and butter Lucario combo, Tito would probably be like at 60-70%. Oh, good lesson. Don't just stay on the platform with Tito. And right now, Aura Aura is slow, trying to slow down the pace right now. But good patience blocking the Tito side view. Oh! Alright, Tito matching jump. I thought that was a release of his uh, nature beat. Nah. It's also hard because if you oh, know... Oh my god, god he died at like 70. From a wall forward smash. Wait, that was forward smash? I thought that was a forward tilt. No! That was forward smash! Oh forward smash is when he does like the command way back. It's a push. His forward tilt is more like a bitch slap. Okay, that, that was, was good. really good. That was a really good recovery from Aura Aura. Instead of just grabbing onto ledge, he just challenged him instead of right over that hitbox of the down smash. Alright. I think he could have reached. Yeah, and right now, Aura Aura making making the game even yet again damn until he did. Damn it, damn it. Yeah, until he blasted that Aura Sphere. That's what Tito was waiting for. Well, all of those multi-jumps no and clutching it out with a 2-0.